I know in your field, you have to deal with emotionally charged situations. And you came from a situation that you might be reminded of traumatic experiences dealing with your work. How do you balance that situations that remind you of the past? That's a great question. And I think I have done so much work on myself. You know, that was one of the things that when I was coming out of the divorce, again, it was either I can be a victim of my circumstances or I can take the bull by the reins and kick it. And that's what mm -hmm. I decided to do. And I move forward and I let go a lot of the past. So I can't think of anything where it was a triggering event for me. You know, I think a lot of times I hear things and I can understand what somebody's going through, but it's not necessarily triggering. And I think that's only because I've done so much work in our firm. We do have a high conflict relationship coach. She's not a therapist, but she's been able to work even with some of our team when they do hit a situation that is kind of triggering to them. And mm -hmm. we don't keep them, you know, on a case where they might be struggling because that's not what's best for the client. I think for me, when I hear things that I've been through before or that I do understand, it brings a sense of awareness, not only for what they're going through, but also part of my job, part of our job here is not just to get them a legal result. It's to mm -hmm. start putting them on a path in their life that puts them in a position that when they're done with us, that legal paper, regardless of what it says, means crap. You know, they're going to take control of their life and they're right. going to change it. And that's, you know, getting them to think about not being a victim. What can we do to set up boundaries so you're not mm -hmm. ending up in the same situation? Those are all things that I take as a responsibility within, you know, our firm as a lawyer. It's not just law. There's so much else that goes into the divorce process. And that's what we're trying to create within our firm is a life change. Lifestyle change. I love that. I think that's so very, very important just when you're helping people change their life.